clock point of a single line so if you pass any values without pointer to a function it is an expensive operation due to pass by value and more complex the data type more expensive it is to resolve this issue we use pointers so asterisk when used with a data type indicates the value is a pointer and ampersand creates a pointer from a variable so i have created this rule of thumb for myself i'm not exactly sure if it's applicable uh, in the future as well but from what i have learned i have created this rule of thumb and it says that when use a pointer uh, when your function takes an input make it as uh, you know star mark or asterisk and in the implementation details as well in the function use star or asterisk but when you call that function use ampersand okay so here you can see i have created one example type counter struck its int then i am using the replace created a replace method replacing the old string with the new string and i am incrementing the counter as well so if you check in the increment of counter that it takes a pointer to the counter struck but while in the implementation details i have not used asterisk and the reason for it is that it is automatically done by a go for structs you don't have to do it manually you can do it if you want to it's your choice and in the main function i'm just creating a counter i have created some variables then i have just printing it before calling the replace function and after calling the replace function yeah that's it for today's video thank you for watching see you in the next one